Hello, and welcome back to... A spell has ex a spell has expired. Welcome back to the spell expiration game. Now, uh, welcome back to Let's Play Dungeons & Dragons, the Temple of Elemental Evil. In our last video, we... played around with identifying scrolls and potions and stuff and made our way back to the moat house and uh, cleared out a, a room, a couple rooms full of bugbears. And uh, in between videos, I, I looted them. Wasn't really anything to write home about. Each of them had a, a few gold pieces, a few silver pieces, so a little bit of increase there. A lot of armor, a lot of studded leather armor. So I picked all that up. A lot of potions. Gave those to Teak so that she can figure what, uh, figure out what they all are. I, you know, we saw one of them use a potion or two. I'm pretty sure these are all cured like wounds. Just a reasonable guess. Don't know what that is, though. Don't know what that one is. Funny green one. So that, that'll be exciting. Hmm. And I think that's about it, as far as that goes. Let us, uh, you know, I wonder if we should... We used all our buffs. I'm gonna try to sleep. Oh, wait, wait, wait. We should identify a couple things first. We should always do that before resting. Or reading, rather. I'm off! Yeah, okay, what, what is the weird green one? What is that? Bull strength. Hmm. I'm gonna hand that to... Callus. That's a spell he casts anyway. Interesting. Alright, let's sleep. Might get in a combat. Didn't. Alright, so everybody's stuff is... Uh, I should have healed her. Uh, oh, well. Okay. I see okay. more sleep in our future. Of course. Wolf is badly injured too, so uh, more heals. Right away. Okay. That's great. I need to heal Ellie again. Right away. Okay. Let's. Uh, oh, you know what? We slept. So, guess what we get to do? That's right, read I'm magic. Off. I'm more interested in the scrolls. Oh wait, we know what that one is. We don't know what this one is. And we don't know what this Will one is. Will do. All right, what did we get? Stinking cloud, all right! We got the fart spell, I love it. And knock, which we, yeah, we had that already anyway. Uh, You can hold these, we're gonna sell them. I, I don't... Yeah. Stinking Cloud, though. Yeah. Let's see if we can... Let's learn that. We're going to save first. Go over here to Rolana. Get that spell. Very well. It worked. What circle is that? That is third circle. Cannot cast it. Oh, well. Uh, now we'll rest because we don't have anything to identify. I wonder if identify works on... Let's try something. It may only work on items. Oh wait, I can do more read magic? All right. Will do. Yeah, this is just... Yeah, cure light wounds. They're all cure light wounds. But I don't think we can stack them until they've been identified. So it is worth the trouble to... Uh... Yeah, it's, it's worth it. Not all at once. I mean, I may do that off screen or something. Cause, uh, okay. But we'll do this last one. I want to see if Identify works. That didn't sound right, but it does work. Well, we're going to sleep anyway. So, wait, what? They don't stack? Then why do they have a number beside them? Is it because one of them was identified with Identify and... The, uh, let's find out. Will do. Okay, we know what those are. So now we have one that's been... Oh, that's serious wounds. Light, light. Serious. Okay. 
should still stop. I'm off. What about you? Okay, this should stack at least on one of these. Um, so no stacking, really? That's awful. Nobody stacks with anybody else, huh? Ew, I don't know if I want to deal. What if I hand them to you? Do I find them suddenly in a pile? Yes, okay. All right, we can work with that. We can work with that. She can hold them for now. I mean, yeah. Do we have any identifies left on this awakeness? No. So we're done. We're going to save and we're going to rest. Wow. I guess maybe we're not getting attacked because we've cleared out this, the, uh, the moat house dungeon. I think the moat house ruins is what's above. So, uh, oh shoot. I said I wouldn't do this, but yes, sir. it's done. <laughs> Ooh, you know what? Hotkeys! Uh, this is gonna be control... Uh, R for read, right? Cannot be assigned. That's for rest and past time. Alright, well then, uh... I don't know, W? Yeah. W. Okay! Right away. An identify can be control I? Nope, that's inventory. Of course it is. What were you thinking? Um, so we got W. Did I try E? I can do E. All right. Cool. Will I'm do. Let's blow through these. I'm off. Oh, there's yes, that. Sir. One out of ten. That is a thing that can happen. Serious. Serious. This is not bad. Serious wounds. We can't even cast that yet. Another rest. Oh, cool. Alright. So, uh, W. I'm off. Okay. W. Oh, do you gotta wait I'm off. Going? Potion. All right, we're gonna identify. All right, cool. Well, that's that's really not bad. And you know, even if I, I think we could sell these, even if we decide we don't want them. I mean, the cure light wounds is kind of a you know, eh. So we'll see. I'm gonna rest again. Why not? Cool. Yeah, I guess we're safe down here. So let's go somewhere where it's not safe. Stairs. I think we've. Is this where that ogre was? I think so. Pretty sure. <laughs> I missed this. What's in here? Uh, we've got a captive and a captive. All right. Well, Teak is the friendliest looking one, so talk to the captive. I am Nibble. Thank you for rescuing me. I am eternally grateful. <laughs> Who said anything about her? <laughs> well, <laughs> yeah, kind of. We just cleared the whole place out and just ignored them. And they're like, what are all those noises out there? Hmm. Teak says, what are you doing down here? I was adventuring down here with my warrior friend Gleam and our cleric friend Chanda. Gleam pulled this huge ogre onto... <laughs> pulled, I'm sorry. I thought that was just kind of terminology you use like... I'm gonna go pull that group over there. Like when you're playing, like warriors wouldn't actually say that. I don't know, whatever. Gleam pulled this huge ogre onto us and it started to beat us to a pulp. That sounds awful. Go on. Well, Shonda just stopped healing us. It was as if she suddenly went to some sort of trance. Gleam was almost dead, so I arranged our surrender to the ogre. I didn't want her to die, but now I think it would have been better if we had just died. Why is that? The ogre has tortured us and beat us badly. I am no longer even afraid of death. And now he intends to eat us, I fear. 
Well, he's dead now. <laughs> he won't be eating anyone else again. Dead, you say? That is pretty impressive. He was not an easy adversary. Yes, you are free to go now. Before we go, please take this iron ring as a gift. It will let all gnomes in the area know that you are a gnome friend, and they should be helpful if you have need. Hmm, I accept your generous gift. But before you leave, is there anything you have learned while in prison here? Strange people come through here, always wearing special cloaks. The ogre would not attack them when they had on the cloak. I suspect there is something much more sinister somewhere beyond. Thank you for the information. Good luck to you, and for farewell. You could also forewell if you'd like to, but, you know. All right, well, uh... Aw. Well, you know, seeing as how she is a gnome, I don't know why we need a small silver ring that was a gift from a gnome you rescued in the moat house. It signifies you as a friend of all gnomes. Okay, well, we'll have the gnome wear the... Uh, okay. That's good, though. That's good. All right. Well, I feel better about that, at least. Lag. Have we tried this? What is this? Very well. Oh, that's what that was. See, I tried to click on it. I tried to do stuff with it earlier, but it didn't cooperate. Oh well. Right away. Just take it right back up. Okay. Cool. Let's go back upstairs. I mean, maybe we did finish everything. Maybe the place that is. That will require a mere fraction of my power. Yeah, I mean, we took that. We did that chest and. And really, there wasn't anything in there of interest. I know we came in through here. Yes, we sir. Explored. Um, so that's just a shortcut to there somehow. I don't see how. I mean, where are the stairs up? Weird. Yes. Well, I spoke too soon. The moat house is, in fact, cleared. So we will take our leave. That will require a mere fraction of my power. What gets me is that I saw... Yeah, that. Can we... That will require... Uh -huh. Ooh. Okay. Uh-huh. Right. Well. Um. So because of his ring of freedom of movement, he should be okay. Everybody else is all webbed and stuff. Well, a lot of people are. Not everybody. Interesting. Alright. Well. We've, we've squished enough spiders in our time already. Let's just uh, keep going. Okay. Of course. Better reload. Yes. <laughs> I guess the, uh, he got out, so that's good. All right, Gorduk, well, you know what to do. Yes, I, I do. Very well. Someone call an exterminator. Something like that. Well, if you're not webbed, so if you want to do it too, you can. Done. Oh, no. Well. Whatever you say. I guess because she had to spend the beginning of her turn breaking free. Poor Ellie here didn't manage to do it, so we're going to spend the rest of your turn trying to break free. Right away. And failing. Oh, Callus got out. That's good. Can you reach this? Right away. No. As you wish. Okie doke. Okay. Nice. Very nice. Even from the web, it's like, haha, I'm ranged. What are you gonna do about it? Very well. Oh man, I was just having such a tough time over there. Oh well. That will require a mere fraction of my power. Never mind, everyone. It's it's quite dead now. 
Ooh, an ivory chest. Hey, Teak. Do the thing. Will do. All right. No, that's not that great. We got a couple pieces of silver here. We'll just take all of this because she's going to have to identify all of it, right? So, yeah. I don't see anything else really going on in here, so I think we're done. For realsies. I, I'm I off. But we're going to we're going to do the read the read and identify right away. Spiel across these. Neutralize poison. That's not bad to have. Right away. Protection from evil. Well, seeing as how we will be venturing into the Temple of Elemental Evil, you know, that might be, might be a good thing to keep around. Who knows? What's this? So we've used up our reeds. That is a charm animal. Mm. It's not really how I play, so that may not really happen. And we use identify. Will do. Yes, sir. Another neutralized poison. Okay. And finally, Ray of Enfeeb. We already know that. Pretty sure we already know that. So that's not really of use to anybody. Charm animal, though. That could probably be of use. And scroll of protection from evil. Yeah, that too. Neutralized poison, huh? I'll just hand these over so that they stack. Mm-hmm. Save and try to have Rolana learn those. Although I, you can't learn Charm Animal. That must be a Druid spell. I'm gonna pass that over to Ellie, and we'll see if maybe that's something she can learn somehow. I, I don't know. Still don't know. All right, learn it. Whatever you say. Why? Thank you. All right. So now she has a uh, protection from evil. Ellie, you've got a scroll on hand. Can you do anything with it? I mean, uh, you can cast it, but as far as learning goes, I'm... Oh, gosh. I feel stupid now. Uh... Druids are like clerics. They don't have to learn spells. They get them all once they're capable of casting a certain circle. And they just pick which ones to memorize for the day. It's it's wizards that need to have a scroll. Okay. Okay. All right. Yes, sir. So really, we've got three casters here, or caster-esques, that just... Well, with, you know what, okay, with the exception of Teak, because she gets to pick what she's going to learn, and that's, that's it. I don't think, I don't think bards can get others. I could be wrong, but she doesn't have a spell book, so this is it. This is it for her. It's going to be like that every time we level. You, you learn something from your list, but, yeah, very limited. That's what, that's what sorcerers do. I know that. Alrighty, enough of that. Let's leave. We're done with the moat house. The moat, the moat house really is cleared now. All right, guys, you have fun doing that while. Who is this? Oh, Teak again. Wait, what am I doing? Just. <laughs> what? What? Why did that ding? Oh, Nob. We could go to Nob. I don't. I don't want to go to Nob right now. I want. I'm gonna go to the comic. Let's sell our junk. Teak, do it. Ah, good. You're back. I was hoping you would return. I could use your help. What do you need? Well, a certain friend of mine is contracted me to open this chest. He lost the key, and he needs a particular item from within. I've tried everything to break into the chest, but the metal was infused with some magical properties, making it near indestructible. Bull crap! I don't know anything about it. She knows about locks. Very disappointing. 
I don't know anything about locks. What do you expect me to do? I'm confident that you might know someone who can do the job. Be a good lass and arrange it for me, and I promise to make it worth your while. Okay, I'll see what I can do. Excellent. Let me know when the job is done. Now, is there anything else I can do for you? Just a few questions. What would you like to know? I don't think we need a healing, do we? I'd like to browse your wares. Ray of Enfeeblement. I I think we had to learn that. I'll, I'll take a look at that before selling it, but we definitely don't need the Scroll of Knock. And we don't need... An wow, look at that. That's like 300 gold. Bye. <laughs> cool. Let's check on this real quick. Raven, yeah, she already knows it. Although, yeah, we don't have anybody else that can learn from scrolls, so... Yeah, just six gold. There you go. Whatever. What else are we hanging on to? I mean, no, we're going to hang on to these. Although the scroll of the 13 gold for each uh, Cure Light Wounds potion. And if we were really short on cash, we could do that. <laughs> Birds just like, chirp! <laughs> chirp! Uh, we're going to hang on to this stuff. What do you have here? Charm animal. I mean, I, I, don't, I don't want it. Serious wounds. I mean, if we're in a bad pinch, sure. That wouldn't hurt to have around. 77 for Potion of Bull Strength. Hmm. He really ought to be holding on to the undead stuff, don't you think? These undead potions. Protection from undead. We'll hold those. I don't know if we'll ever use them. If I... I'm not going to hoard stuff. If it starts to look like, yeah, I'm not going to use that, then I will sell them. Yeah, all right, that's, we got some healthy, healthy cash there. Uh, none of this is refreshed, has it? I really want to get her a shield made out of wood. So wait, why am I talking to a smith? I wonder if the woodcutter's got anything that we could use. That might be worth looking at. Let's, let's go check real quick. I don't know where else to get, like, a wooden shield. Oh, where is it? Where's the woodcutter? That's not it. Over here. It's just worth looking at real fast. Tarim, the guy who gave us the quest that allowed us to not be so terrible. By the gods' will. I'm back. Oh god. Yes, well, uh, the streets of town are so much safer now that those moat house bandits are gone. May I ask some more questions? What can I do for you? Uh, so what are you going to do with all that uh, Declo wood? So what are you going to do with that Declo wood now? Well, first I'm going to cut up a bunch of it for the carpenter. I might try to replant some in the grove there, too. It's good to keep the proper balance. Perhaps you can answer a few more questions. What can I do for you? Um... <laughs> Are there any more spiders around that need clearing out? That job was rather satisfying. No, that Declo Grove will keep me busy for a while. But thanks again for all your help. Can I ask some more questions? You look at the children playing in the area. So, how's the family, Tarim? Uh-oh. My poor wife, Ganna, she's always making more clothes for the children. She spends an hour over at the Weavers. And my youngest, Amy, is always ill. I wish there was better healing here in Hamlet for her. Hmm. Is there anything I can do to help little Ami, Ami, whatever that? Whatever her damn name is, I didn't hear exactly what you said. I wasn't paying attention. I was thinking about spiders. I think only a full heal would cure her now. I'm really afraid we might lose her. But I'll be damned if I go to that Cuthbert fellow up north. If Jaru can't heal her, then no one can as far as I'm concerned. 
Ooh, that's pretty uh, small-minded, really. You know, like only my religion can do this. I'm like, are you sure? Okay. <laughs> um, this just seems like a real dick thing to say, and he's not a dick. He's he's just chaotic neutral. What are you gonna do? Well, I am sure Jeru can help. I will talk to him about it. I guess we just got a quest, everybody. I didn't want to. I'm off. <laughs> but, but we had to save a little girl. Come on. Let's go talk to Jaru briefly. About uh, this do-gooder quest that uh, Gorduk just s ensnared the party into. Where's his tree? Where's the tree? Dang, I swear. It's right, it's down, down. Oh, this is probably it. Yeah. I guess maybe we can check with the carpenter instead of the woodcutter Very well. about a wooden shield. I mean, that wouldn't be so bad, right? Well, Gorduk, it seems that you're the party face now. <laughs> Wait, what's this? Ooh. What's in there? He'd probably get angry if we tried to loot it, though. Hello again. Mm. Oh, okay. Well, this is also important. I've cleared the boathouse now, Jaru. You can send that report. Everything is safe around here now. That is good, my son. I shall send a report to Rudek tomorrow. But I fear there may yet be more disturbance in the area. What? When the Temple of Elemental Evil was destroyed ten years ago, I'm afraid some of it remained intact. And the funny thing is, some of it, yeah, when we get there, the place is massive. I don't know how you missed it, guys. Yes, go on. At the time, I urged the invaders to seal off the lower levels and let it be, that enough had been done to the balance and that it was over. They took my advice, but perhaps I was hasty in my evaluation. Hasty? I think there is something down there, something terrifying, something that seeks to unbalance the world. I fear the day is near at hand when it will come forth once again, and that Nulb will once again thrive. Is that such a bad, is it so bad to have a town do? Ah, uh, yes, I know where Nulb is. I think I shall have to investigate it further. Thanks, Jaru. I was not done talking to you, sir. Hello again. Can we talk about Amy? Amy. We're going to decide now. It's Amy. Are you sure? Yeah, that's what I want it to be. Okay, then, Jaru, can we talk about Amy? Yes, my son. What is it you would know? Why is Amy here? Wait, is she here? Like, oh, is that her right there? Oh. Well, that's a fair question, then. Why is Amy here? Oh, I have to read it. Tarim and Gana have asked me to find a cure for Amy. She has been staying with me while I research her problem. Do not worry, Gorduk. Her parents are of are off. See, it looks like of ten here visiting. You see that? Come on, guys. Kerning. Do not worry, Gorduk. Her parents are often here visiting. Amy is loved by many. She is one of Biori's flock, as are we all. Yeah, that's that's great, but uh, Tari mentioned a full here, a full heal to cure her. I wish it were so. If a mere healing spell would have cured her ailment, then I would have healed her long ago. Believe me, I have tried everything within my power. Still, I have one path yet untried. Perhaps you could aid me in this endeavor. Oh, crap. Is, is this going to be a a quest because I, I really what can I do to help I once read about a healing powder that can be made from swamp lotus and I believe that this powder will heal her the problem of course is that I have not seen a swamp lotus in many many moons they have become quite rare I fear too rare if you manage to find one of these flowers then please bring it to me immediately <laughs> that's horrible but no uh Okay, Zeru. I will keep an eye out for this flower. 
Well, we just accepted a quest, everybody. Girl. Hello again. No, I was trying to talk to her. Can I not? Hello again. I cannot. Let's talk to the guard. Yes, sir. How can I help you? Are you the village guard? Yes, sir. I am one of Bernie's badgers. He says this proudly. <laughs> Who are Bernie's badgers? We work for Bernie. His most worshipful... Uh, okay. So that threw me off. We work for Bernie, his most worshipful mage, mage of Hamlet. I'm embarrassed to say that we used to be brigands, but Bernie has showed us a better way of life. We act as the town guard and expect people to behave responsibly while here. Who is Bernie? Bernie Sanders? You don't know Bernie Sa Bernie is a wizard who came to Hamlet many years ago with his friend Rufus. They defeated many enemies in the surrounding countryside, including the bandit group that they later formed into the Badgers. Where can I find Bernie now? Bernie and Rufus live in the tower on the east side of town. I must be off. That will require a mere fraction of my power. Okay. Uh... I don't know where the carpenter is, so instead of uh, you know running around in circles and having everybody watch me do that, I'm gonna call it a video here. I'm gonna find out where the carpenter is and see if it's even worth going to him or her. And yeah, we will uh, we'll pick up at the next video, I guess. Uh, I guess we're going to Nob. Sounds like it, huh? Yeah. All right. Well, thanks for watching, and I'll see you then.